Hi, this is Lee Giles from Easy Peasy Yellow and Homeschool. Our scripture is Ezekiel 43, 12, the first part. <laughs> and this is the New Living Translation. And this is the basic law of the temple, absolute holiness. There's a large portion of Ezekiel that this comes in where the temple is measured. A measuring rod is drawn and Ezekiel is taken around and sees all the measurements of everything. And everything is a precise measure. The measure of the length from here to there matches exactly the length from there here to here. <laughs> the next place. Things are perfectly symmetrical. There's a precise number of stairs. Everything is laid out just so, precisely, perfectly, down to the adornments, such as palm tree carvings. Ezekiel then sees the throne room, and God's glory fills the place. Ezekiel's told the law of the temple, that everything, including the area of the mountain it sits on, must be holy. The New, Transla the New Living Translation puts it this way. This is the basic law of the temple, absolute holiness. Although there seems to be another temple built for Jesus' millennial reign, where is Jesus' temple now? We are God's temple. Ephesians 2 ends with, You are fellow citizens with the saints and members of the household of God, built on the foundation of the apostles and prophets, Christ Jesus himself being the cornerstone, in whom the whole structure being joined together grows into a holy temple in the Lord. In him you also are being built together into a dwelling place for God by the Spirit. We are the temple, each of us and all of us. We are to be absolutely holy. Holy means set apart. Holy unto the Lord means set apart for him. A plate is a plate, but when it is consecrated and set apart for God's purposes, then it's holy and useful for holy acts like holding the bread of presence in the temple. We need to keep ourselves from being used for common purposes and be set apart for God to be used for His purposes. In order to be holy, set apart for God, we need to be set apart from the world. Be ye separate. Ask the Lord to make you holy and allow Him to remove the common things from your life.